I know the, the piano's a little jarring. It's temporary, I think, right there. Not sure. But welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Boss or I should know. We have episode 36 of our Dragon Ball Super Watch for today. And it's Vegeta versus Mageta, a robot. The robot is technically a living thing. And honestly, it looks pretty dead even right now. Although Champa did kind of adjust the rules so that Vegeta wasn't able to fly up really high and avoid Mageta's attacks. But at what point did all these fights have integrity, anyways? We're gonna hop right into it. If you're new to the channel, drop a sub and hit that big blood bell, and let's get started. I just like these random phrases. I guarantee you someone out there has a dictionary with Magetta's language. Google Translate. I said it was even, yeah. I mean, he's just such a tank. It's gonna be an endurance thing. No way is he cheating too, right? Oh no. Yeah, what's going on here? I mean, aside from him changing the size of the arena. My brother only laughs like that when he's up to no good. <laughs> you can hear him laughing from over there. You gotta get down while you can. What? Why? He rises. Wow. He doesn't care about safety. It was all just a trick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, it was just because of the barrier. Is it seeping out? Oh, no, there's something going. The referee. He's like, God damn, it's hot in here. Dude, Champa's shameless, man. For real. At least you'll have a better chance of breathing there. Quiet. Vegeta don't like being coached. Tell me how to fight. Yeah. If my oxygen's running out, that just means I need to deal with this quickly. <laughs> Giga Chad. I mean, he he needs to get like one fat hit in, but that's the thing is Magetta's defense is crazy. Oh no! Like I just demonstrated with Bulma, a fighter's gotta be fast on his feet. Was he talking to us? <laughs> Lava! My goodness. That is insane. No, the ref! Well, that guy is not getting paid enough. Oh, oh, there's something else in that steam. Brother. Oh, wait, he's combining it. It explodes. Oh, my gosh. No shot. Vegeta going to lose to a robot. Woo. He just set up some kind of bomb. How's that not a weapon? So by their logic, Magetta's more human than the androids we know. He actually farted. Oh, he actually said toot. He's not going to be able to go Super Saiyan soon. Nah, that's what that's what they say whenever he's definitely not met his match. He has to win this, though. I mean, we've been pretty down bad on our side. Oh, so he mean business. Like I said, one fat hidden. He needs something. Okay, he's just charging key. Can he go Super Saiyan Blue like he did in Resurrection F? Or is, is it just because he's like completely exhausted at this point? How hot is inside? I'd like to get an idea of the temperature though, too. I think he's straight up just charging. He's going to try to shoot it in his mouth, maybe? Wait for his mouth to open? It's a fat beam. It's not Gallic Gun, is it? He didn't yell Gallic Gun. Oh, it's a beam clash. What is the lava doing? It's hardening. Huh? Wait, I think the robot is going up there. It was a screen. Oh, who's got a, a club? Yo, hey, you got, you got to admit, that was pretty insane. Oh my gosh. No. He's out. Oh no, not like this. Is he standing or is he floating like an inch above the ground? Kind of looks like he's still hovering a bit. Come on, stop teasing me. <laughs> Enhance. There's no way. It's gonna build all this up and he's just standing. Come on! Beerus about to throw like a temper tantrum. Look real close, Mr. Referee. <laughs> okay, why did it tease it that long? You're so far up there. He's going to show them the, the cam. Oh, let's go. How lucky, bro. Go ref. Now Beerus can't make the argument that the ref is bought. You. There's nothing I love more than watching my brother cry. <laughs> oh my gosh! What a healthy relationship. Try to imagine how our proud Vegeta feels about this. That he's getting beat? Oh yeah, he's pissed. One million percent. No, he is angry. Look at this man. How does he win? This robot's like an immovable object. You, referee. Um, yeah. What do you need? 
<laughs> you can't touch the barrier, right? Uh, yeah. That works. What is this man thinking, bro? Wait, bring the barrier to him. Should have just repelled it. Oh, we got on him. So that's what a seventh universe Saiyan can do. <laughs> what can this Saiyan do? Oh! What does he do? Oh, he is gonna break the barrier. Oh! If there's no barrier, there's no limiting space. Dang! Oh my God, bro, this guy is an animal. Oh no, what about the spectators? Gold. I'm finally starting to see how he could be the toughest guy in the whole universe. I still don't understand. This is going to be the longest running joke in the series. I bet on it. All right. Well, that that hot air can't get trapped in anymore. But well, Vegeta is still kind of uh, exhausted a bit, especially I'm guessing after that. Is that final flash? Are these, isn't that the stance for final flash? Like arcing. Oh my gosh. Like uncontrollable. Chugga, chugga. <laughs> He's like, I can do that too. It's gonna destroy the whole arena. Dude, that character design for Magetta is so good. It's so good. He is trying. Oh, it is Final Flash. I'm so proud of myself for recognizing the pose. It's gotta be stronger. It's much stronger. He broke the barrier. The sunglasses. It's gonna overload. It is overloading. <laughs> oh wait, he's dizzy. Oh, he blocked. Nah, yeah, he's not done. That like hurt his feelings. Oh, it did. Oh, GG, that's it. Goku's like, that's my Vegeta. Surely he doesn't like stop. No, yep, that's it. That is game, baby. That's my Saiyan. Let's go! He's like easy peasy. Didn't even sweat it. I guess you should have given me time to strengthen that barrier. <laughs> Bro, the dome this fixes it instantly. Look at the stage! Sniff, sniff, sniff. Uh, whoa, is he crying? Don't feel bad, Magetta. You see, Magetta was rather hurt by the remark. Thick skin, the metal man race are extraordinarily sensitive. And the right insult during combat can reduce them to a puddle, rendering them helpless. Apologize, Vegeta! And didn't say anything, even what Vegeta was about to oh, so if he had insulted him during the fight. Oh my gosh. I mean, if you just wanted a quick win, you could have powered up at the start. That's what I was saying, man. But that's a lot of like, I feel like drag what Dragon Ball is in terms of the power scaling. Please don't tell me that guy's next. Nah, he has to be the last fighter. Is the Saiyan next? Dude, why do I feel like this this kid's gonna get just like obliterated? Now it's my turn to fight. I mean he From seems shocked by Vegeta's next power. Vegeta versus another Saiyan. Well that fight delivered for sure. Best fight of the of this like I guess tournament so far. Even outmatching the the frost stuff. Just because like I said, I like Magetta's design and just the whole robot thing is just cool to me. I don't know why. Plus, you know, like the scale of everything with the stage getting blown apart. But now we're getting to the character that I'm most intrigued by though is like I said the Saiyan and whoever this other guy is that we've already seen sort of what his powers do who seems like he's going to literally not be beatable and of course we still have Manaka but guys that's been it for episode 36 of our Dragon Ball Super Watch so drop a fat like on this one if you haven't already and I'll catch you in the next one peace peace